had were here seven years ago in Port Macquarie? Uh, seven and a half years ago in Port Macquarie, John made his first visit and my husband had had bowel cancer surgery two months earlier. So I went along to one of his meetings and I went up for prayer for myself, but I also went up for my husband. Yeah. And, um, and then, you know, in his early 50s, he was diagnosed with stage one bowel cancer and had surgery. And um, so I came to the meeting and John asked me, did I have anything of my husband's that we could pray over? So I just rattled through my bag and I had a clean tissue. That was all I had. So he prayed over that tissue and after the surgery, my husband had a colostomy bag on for about eight months, which is what they do in order for the bowel to heal. And uh, so they, they put a colostomy bag on him. And uh, so he was getting a lot of uh, pains from, uh, you know, just from the surgery and the bag. So at night, he put this tissue over his stomach in order to be able to get some sleep. And, you know, we, he, dubbed that tissue the magic tissue so that every night he would place his tissue over his stomach just to settle things down and it did and we still have that tissue which is now yellow. The pain would die then we put it on? Yeah, yeah. I mean he, you know, I, I, not that he was a believer but he just just did it. I think to appease me I just said look just put it on me. So every night he did that, and we still have that tissue. It's quite yellow, but it stays in my top drawer of my dresser. Oh, <laughs> and it's brought out for anybody who has stomach pain or whatever, and we just, yeah. It's amazing, because, because you, know, you know, God can anoint anything. You know, like, like yeah. Apostle Paul, that took his aprons so was off him and laid them on people, they were healed. You know, it's amazing, anointing can, can, um, can uh, touch or permeate certain objects for healing and, and, and Paul they took from Paul they were healed and we've seen so many miracles yeah,